percent. Wanted to tell you guys about my first business because I never really did that before. Um, in sixth grade, I used to go down to the candy store and buy candy when it was one penny, just the penny candy. I just get bags of it. Like I had, a, I walked a dog, <sighs> or had an allowance or something. Very small. I, I didn't really have an allowance. I remember getting a job walking a dog. I think I was in seventh grade. Anyway, somehow I'd get like a, a dollar or a few, just, you know, 50 cents or whatever together, dollar, and I'd go up to the, the to Alfredo's and get penny candy, bags of it, i just fill it up, and then bring it back and set out a, a bench out in front of my house and sell them for 10 cents to the neighborhood kids, whoever was walking by, and sometimes my mom would make Kool-Aid, and we'd be able to sell the Kool-Aid. But I didn't think of that as an, it wasn't really part of the expense because she would make it. It was like free and it was super profitable. But since I didn't pay for it, I didn't feel like it was my, like my business. It was kind of her helping us. But the penny candy sold really well. And I had a game where I would take my bicycle and turn it upside down on the handlebars so that the front wheel was like up. And I had a bag of clothespins and I would spin the front wheel and charge people a quarter for to throw a clothespin, try and get it through the spinning wheel, through the spokes, and if they could get it through, they'd get all the money. But it was like impossible to get it through, so people would just do it. I did, and that only did a little bit. I mainly sold the candy. And then it went up to two cents, and I kept selling ten cents, and some candy I think was like five cents I would sell, and some for ten. That was kind of my first business. And I tried, so I tried to sell it at school, but a guy blackmailed me. and was like, sell to me for cheap, or I'll tell the teachers you're selling it. Jason Moyer, you fucker, wherever you are. I'm not, I don't actually hold a grudge. You taught me a good lesson. Have a permit if you're going to be a salesman. Make sure it's legal. All right, see you.